The House of Representatives has decided to investigate allegations of irregular activities within the Federal Housing Authority. The motion presented by engineer Sosa Iyawe, who represents Oredo Federal Constituency, was supported by other lawmakers and received widespread approval. Engineer Iyawe raised concerns about claims of recurring and deviations from the original housing plans approved by the federal government. These plans were meant to include green spaces, recreational facilities, banks, health centers, and community centers to ensure better living conditions for Nigerians. However, it was alleged that the federal Federal Housing Authority ignored these plans and repurposed areas designated for public amenities, such as green spaces and recreational centers for residential use. This was reportedly done in Lagos and Abuja, prioritizing profits over safety and community welfare. Mr. Speaker, I rise to move a motion on the need to investigate and address the deviations of federal government approved master plans of federal housing estates for excessive profiteering. Mr. Speaker, the House notes that the Federal Housing Authority was established, amongst other functions, to provide, develop, and manage real estate on a commercial basis in all states of the Federation, as well as prepare and submit proposals for national housing programs. Mr. Speaker, the House is aware that the Federal Housing Authority executes the housing programs proposed and submitted after getting approvals from the federal government. The House is informed that the approvals of the estate includes conducive, serene, and tranquil living spaces, approved site plans, development timelines, green areas, recreational facilities, community centers, and general service areas for banks, health centers, post offices, and shopping malls. Mr. Speaker, the House is concerned that after the commencement of construction and subscription by the public, the Federal Housing Estate surreptitiously deviates from the approved plan in Gusape, Lube, and Lagos by converting spaces approved for green areas, recreational centers, and general utilities to living spaces sold at premium to unsuspecting subscribers. Mr. Speaker, the House is also concerned that spaces meant for drainery, drainages, and channeling of flood waters are converted and constructed upon, endangering the lives of subscribers who have bought into this initial plan of affordable serenity and tranquility of FHA estates for excessive profiteering. Mr. Speaker, the House resolves to mandate the Committee on Public Assets to investigate the deviations from the approved plans and reports within four, four weeks for further legislative action. Mr. Speaker, I so move. Lawmakers urged the involvement of relevant communities to ensure a thorough investigation. The motion received overwhelming support from the House, led by Right Honorable Tajuddin Abbas. Mr. Speaker, I want to make an amendment in the resolution uh, on his... Uh, the resolution. Instead of public access to investigate these, the committees that I believe are necessary here are the committees on housing and habitat and urban development and regional planning. I so amend. Are you saying that we should delete committee on uh, public asset and replace with all you are talking about additional committees? Which of the two? Additional committees. Additional committees to work with uh, the one earlier suggested, right? Yes, sir. You see, if you look at the content of this motion, it's talking about recreational facilities, green areas, community centers, and all these are about habitat. And it's a committee on habitat. Uh, that is housing and habitat. So the relevant committee is the committee for housing and habitat. So are you suggesting that uh, public assets should be deleted? Yes, sir. And uh, replaced with housing and habitat? Yes, sir. This amendment should say aye. Those against should say nay. The eyes have it. Irene Ejoba, PFM TV News.